Hello everyone, it's Kiki, and welcome to my channel. This week, um, I did Matt Mercer in his dungeon masteriness, and a few of the NPCs that he has created. Um, the NPCs being Gilmore, Allura, and Kima, who are my favorites. Gilmore is just fabulous, and Kima is sassy, and Allura is awesome. But I had fun with this trying to get Matt's hair to look as fabulous as it actually is was difficult, but I did my best. Um, over the course of creating all of the Critical Role pictures, I feel like I've gotten a lot better at time management. Like, I've been getting better since I got the YouTube channel, but like, really over the last few weeks with doing the Critical Role stuff, I feel like I've gotten a lot better, like, as as I've done them, the times it's taken me to do them, but still get good results, has shortened. Like when I did Keyleth, that was closer to like, I think eight or nine hours it took me. Whereas all the way down here at Matt now, it's only like five hours. So, improvements, yay! Like with Pax, I did a general rough sketch on paper for Gilmore Kima and Alora. Just one because I didn't have time to get on the computer to do the sketch, because I was doing stuff with family. But also, just for some reason I'm able to sketch better on paper than I am on the computer. I don't know why, but I like I like making the rough sketches on paper, so that's probably going to be a thing that happens more often now in my videos. I'm going to try and every now and then actually take video of me doing the sketches on paper, it's probably not going to happen very often, just because the cameras I have at my disposal are not the greatest. I might have to steal my dad's. But no, I had I had fun with this. I had fun with, you know, Gilmore and, and Kima and e even Allura, even though her design's a little bit more simple. Um, I'm really happy with how Gilmore turned out. Kind of, I kind of imagine the three of them kind of just, they're walking somewhere and Gilmore's telling a story and being go more about it and Kima's making a comment which makes Alora laugh. The idea of it is Matt has them in his hands like because he's like you know they're like supposed to look like they're coming out of his hands because he created it. It's words that make sense but I'm sure you can understand the general gist of it. I ended up making Gilmore a little tubby because of the, the kit bus pictures I found. He's a little tubby. But like, I found a bunch of other pictures where he's like, strapping, and I was like, I don't know what to do, so I just stuck with the kit bus picture. Which I really like. Um, I did add like, little things here or there, like I gave him the necklaces, and I put the earring on, and stuff. I don't really think I changed much else about it. Oh, and I gave him like, rings. But yeah, I had a little trouble with his fingers, his fingers are wonky. But no, I had fun with this, and I actually took, I was expecting this one to take the longest out of all of them just because I was doing multiple characters and I think it's actually one of the shorter ones. Um, I think out of all of them, Vax was actually the shortest one that took me to do, the, the shortest amount of time, um, but I think Matt was second. I'd have to actually go back and look at the full times. I think this took me six hours. Yeah, I think it was six hours. Five and a half or six. I had had the idea for what I wanted to do with Matt pretty much since the beginning of the idea of this entire project. I actually feel I executed it fairly well. The idea of him kind of being the more ethereal being in the background, just kind of pushing the narrative, because that's basically what he is. And so, you know, I, when I did like the background stuff, I made it all like, woo, mystically and, and stuff. And then I like, I brought it around sort of in front of him to hide a little bit of his body and to make it look a little less weird that his hands are detached. But I like I like what I did with it. I like how it turned out. I'm really happy with it. I didn't know how much of his body I was going to kind of essentially cut off, so I just made sure to color in the whole thing and, and shade it all just so I wasn't having to go back and change things or I wasn't restricting myself to a certain cutoff point. I don't have too much else to say other than Matt is awesome and Critical Role is awesome and D D is awesome. I did make but a video of me putting together the group picture, which was annoying in and of itself. So that'll be a video. I don't know if I'll put it up next week. I might just to have a video. Yeah. 
so I'm gonna be quiet now, unless I think of something else to say, and let you watch.
Alright, so it's coming to the end of this video and have everybody all done from campaign one of Critical Role and a few NPCs. And next week I'll post me smushing everybody together into a single picture. It'll be a very short video, but it'll be a video nonetheless. I'll see you next week.